Hey guys and welcome back to another YouTube video here on my channel and yeah in today's video I want to show you guys how to install Homebrew on the new Apple Macs with the M1 chip. So as you guys can see I'm already on the website from Homebrew right now and yeah I will also put a link to this website down in the video description below. And yeah, to start downloading Homebrew on our M1 Max, we will need to open the terminal. So I will just click on command space to open my spotlight search and then look for terminal. And yeah guys, once you have opened your terminal, the first thing you will need to do is to copy and then paste in this install Homebrew script. So I will just click here on copy. Then go back to my terminal and then paste it in here and just click enter. So now you will have to put in your sudo password, so just the password for your Mac in order to install Homebrew. And yeah guys, after you have put in your password, it will install Homebrew. Now you will just have to return, so these new directories will be created and if you will accept it, just press return. And yeah, if you want to abort this installation process, just press any other key instead of return. But I want to continue, so I will just press return. And yeah, now it's going to download Homebrew. All right guys, so this is done. I will just put my terminal in full screen mode. And yeah, you guys can see now we have this warning here. Homebrew slash bin is not in your path. So therefore we have to look down here at the next steps. So we will have to run these two commands in your terminal to add homebrew to your path. So we will just have to take this command lines right here and then just copy and paste them again in our terminal. And now we can run brew help to see if everything has downloaded correctly. And yeah, now we can also try out the command brew list. And yeah, as you guys can see, if we are running the command brew list, we can see that we have an empty list of applications that we have installed. So yeah, to change that, we can install a not. So we make brew install not. And yeah, it will be downloading the node now. And yeah guys, after we installed the node, we can check again with brew list to see if it's listing our node. And yeah, as you guys can see, we just installed all of this. So yeah guys, that was actually all I wanted to show you in this quick video on how to install Homebrew on your new Apple M1 Max. If you guys have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comments below and I will try to help all of you. Also, if you guys enjoyed watching this quick video, please don't forget to smash the like button for my YouTube algorithm. And yeah, hopefully see you guys in the next video. Have a great day and... Bye.